okay? Um, haven't seen him uh, really in about, what, almost eight, nine months or something like that. Try six. Yeah, yeah, so um, we needed to, this is what we do our, all our lives, and we needed to play, play some music together, so, uh, and uh, this is our, our good friend and great bass player Jim D'Ascenzo here on, on the bass, and uh, play some tunes for you, so let's get this going. Been a while. Yeah, it's been a little bit. Bear with us. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you. Well, that's one. We've got one. Dust off those cobwebs a little bit. for John Prime. back to back here so it's your turn now dad love when you do that 
We, ne we never have a set list either, every time. <laughs> I keep thinking this pedal's working. I'm trying to step on it. And it's not even putting it in. Oh, somebody help me. Why don't I have no road? Not up for that one, yes, I'm not leaving my uncle. It's an old Merle song. about the words. Yeah, it's been a while. Oh, you nailed it. Come on. <laughs> it's been a while. These guitars love the humidity, don't they? 
I was up in uh, Wells, Wellsboro, PA last night. Beautiful up there. Uh, the fall falls kind of happening with the trees and stuff. And uh, but we saw um, Eagle Mania last night. Eagles tribute. They killed it. They were so good. I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. And um, you don't realize how many hits those guys have until it's like one after another for three hours, and then you're like, oh wow. Yeah. It was outdoor, yeah, yeah, oh yeah. Very, very, uh, well, very well put together event by a good buddy of mine, uh, Dr. Mike, as he's known. <clears throat> but um, we're going to play an Eagles song. I love the Eagles, just to let you know. <laughs> good, good old one. Uh, Against your skin so brown And I want to sleep with you in the desert tonight With a million stars all around I get a peaceful, easy feeling And I know you won't let me down found out a long time ago what a woman can do to your soul all oh, but she can take you
Hey, thanks a lot. I was, I was singing loud rock and roll music all weekend and my, my voice is a little fried. Another thing I'm not used to doing is uh, playing three hour gigs, right? Singing over um, blazing guitar amps. It was really nice to do that. Fun. Yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah, it was great. Let's see where this guy goes here. Right above here? Uh oh, I'm getting Capo involved. Capo, Capo. Oh, yeah, this is going. That's right. Hey, I just want to give a shout out here to um, to, to Ed for asking us to come to play here. This is a beautiful place that they have, and we just we're, we're so happy to be here. Yeah, it's way cool. Thank you. Better tune her up. Yep. We got an old, an old George Harrison number here for you. I've been getting way into George lately, man. The All Things Must Pass, that... That album stands right there with, with any of the great Beatles records. It's right right there with Abbey Road and all those ones. So, so good. Love it. I'll try. You ready? Here we go. Here comes the sun. Here comes the sun I said It's alright Little darling It's been a long, long, lonely winter Little darling It seems like years since it's been here Here comes the sun Here comes the sun Returning to the faces Little darling It seems like years since it's been here Here comes the sun Here comes the sun I said it's alright Thank you. Thank hey, you, George. Let's get a hand for my dad over here playing guitar for you. So cool. Great to be here. Thanks for having me. You're lucky, lucky to get to do this. It's very, very cool. Very, very rewarding.
first time. All right, I'm going to keep playing um, AM Gold Classics for you guys. <laughs> Promise we'll get back to the Grateful Dead in a minute here, but... Just saying, yeah, you're gonna you're gonna know the song as soon as I start it. Oh no, you start it. <laughs> oh wow, wow. Yeah, this is an AM tune. Right? AM gold, baby. Good as it gets. Falling in and out of love with 
Hey, I just want to also uh, thank Lois because she she's the one who actually emailed me and reached out to me and uh, she made this happen too. So thank you so much. I will play in your backyard anytime. <laughs> What's that? Craig Fuller. Fuller. Yeah, what a voice, right? I think... Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, uh, uh, how many years ago was that? So this this lovely couple was sitting right here. I played their wedding seven years ago, and uh, it was an awesome time. And I'm so glad to see you guys here. So cool. So, yeah. And still going strong. That's awesome. Right on. So. Way cool. What do you have? Oh, it's your turn. Wow. Again? <laughs> okay, I got a couple see. ideas for you. Okay. <laughs> All right, here you'll find out where I got my... Uh, Signature version of uh, this old, old traditional number here. You gotta do my version tonight, boy. That's right. <laughs> you guys know Gonzo? No, no, no. Nobody knows Gonzo. Gonzo, you, Michael, you reeled it good. in. I'm being good. You reeled it in, and I, yes, I did. I greatly appreciate it. Man. For you, Michael, anytime. You're a pleasure, buddy. Yeah. That's Gonzo, huh? That is the infamous God. Definitely infamous. I can't believe that you never, you guys never met. Nope, nope, but I see where you got your talent from. That's right. He taught me everything I know, Gonzo. Ready? Let's do it. I do it in G, is that Yeah, right? yeah, man. Would 
you marry me, pretty Peggy O. If you would marry me, I'd set your cities free. Free all the ladies in the area. I would marry you, sweet William. I would marry you, sweet William. I would marry you, but you can't. And I fear my mama would be angry. What would your mama think, pretty Peggy? What would your mama think, pretty Peggy? Heard my guineas claim Saw me marching down the roads With my soldier
Thank you. Thank you. Never enough reverb. Here's another good AM radio classic. <laughs> I like the older I get, the more the slower I like the songs. <laughs> Sounds about right. Some uh, weird mixture of the olden and the way version and the, I guess, our version, right?
But I don't have much time Faith must have been broken Now tears must be cried So let's do some living After we die And wild horses Couldn't drag me away And wild horses Will ride them someday Thank you. What is that? Some uh, feedback group coming out of somewhere. I think we have a bad mark. Oh man, we're doing so good there too. There you go. It's a bad mark. <laughs> Give us one second and uh, we'll be right with you. We're gonna fix a little technical issue here. I thought it was starting to storm out or something. I know they won. Timmy, did you hear that feedback to the song? I didn't hear it. Something wrong with the cable. But I didn't hear it. Oh, I know that, but they straightened it. Well, Monkey, I didn't notice it till the very end of the song yeah, when it stopped. My jacket. Oh, there you go. Oh, I feel like it's the connection of the battery. Even if it's not the actual battery, then it's the connection. Yeah. More likely the connection than the battery. I'll do a couple solo tunes here for you guys. And Broken wheels. Let them, let them, uh, Fix up that battery or guitar situation there. You want to hear Broken Wheels, Gonzo? Dude, I, I would yeah. love it, man. All right. I'll play that for you, brother. Hey, Angie, you made it. I didn't think you were gone. What's up? What's up, Thanks, dude? Timmy. <laughs> Good to see you guys. Long time no see, huh? What was that? I was like... 2 a.m. last night yeah, I saw you. Well, uh, I was up this morning at like 4.30 down in that little backstage area, like getting something to eat, just laying on that couch in the green room. <laughs> yeah. And then I actually, when I left Wellsboro this morning, it was right as the sun was about to start coming up, and I was like, yeah, I'll get a couple hours driving in, you know, had a long way to go, and uh, drove a good... You know, drove up into town, into Wellsboro, then got on Route 6. Drove a good half an hour before I realized I was on Route 6 West. Wrong <laughs> <laughs> one. Oh, man. Hey, beautiful. Right when the, man, when the sun came up this morning over that countryside there, wow, that was something special. Um, it's kind of worth it, to be honest with you. That real orangey glow and all the leaves are turning. It's fantastic. I'd move up there and... Uh, you know, build myself a little cabin. Spend the rest of my life up there in those woods in a heartbeat.
All right, I'm going to play a song for my buddy here. My infamous Gonzo. Thank you. This is one of my uh, earlier heartfelt love songs. <laughs> Doing well. It's called Broken Wheels. Daydream one more time. 
to sift through the madness in my mind. Broken wheels stop spinning round and turn my smiles upside down and turn my smiles upside down. Broken Wheels. Yeah. That was one of the first, first songs that I wrote that I, I, um, I was like, yeah, I think I could do this songwriting <laughs> thing. <laughs> so I branched out. I was playing a lot of like, I was writing a lot of almost prog rock songs, you know, before that. You know, loud guitar and yeah. instrumental parts. And I was like, wait a minute, there's something to this solo acoustic thing. <laughs> and, the, and the girls seemed to like it. <laughs> you know, playing prog rock, it's like, yeah. You know. I, I mean, I love some good old Yes Genesis. Right. Yeah, me too, man. I love all that stuff. I mean, I totally love that. I, I um, watched the documentary on Rush, man. That, that was a phenomenal documentary. I mean, those guys, whether you like them or you don't, I mean, the amount of talent in that band, the amount of noise that three guys made is was righteous. Okay, uh, I'm going to play... An, Another AM Gold classic. Because I know that's what you guys want to hear. Yeah. This is a real good This is one of my favorites by far. Gordon, come on, Gordon. My buddy Bob, I used to have a, a, a drummer buddy, and, um, and uh, he, you know, he'd get a couple beers in him, and he would sing this at karaoke, man, and he would, he would he'd, he'd light the place up. It was, it was great. <laughs> I miss that guy. He's down in Texas. My, actually, my dad would know. He used to do it at the penalty box there, music, and uh, we'd egg him on. Fantastic. Played this yesterday, so forgive me if you heard it twice. There's a port on a western bay in a surf. Ships a day roam the sailors pass the time away and talk about their home. And there's a girl in this harbor town who works laying whiskey down to say brandy, fetch another round. She serves them whiskey and wine. The sailors say brandy, you're a fine girl. Could steal a sailor from the sea. Brandy wears a braided chain made of finest silver from the north of Spain. There's a locket, there's the name of a man that Brandy loved. He came on a winter's day bringing gifts from far away, but he made it clear. He could not stay, no harbor was his home. The sailors say, Brandy, you're a fine girl. What a good wife you could be. And your eyes could steal a sailor from the sea. Yeah, Brandy used to watch his eyes. He told his sailor stories. She could feel the ocean falling right. All his rage and glory But she had always told the truth Lord, he was an honest man Brandy does her best to understand At night, when the bars close down Brandy walks 
through a silent town and loves a man who's not around she still can hear him say she hears him say brandy you're a fine girl what a good wife you would be my home my love my lady is the sea yeah brandy You gotta love that song. Come on. A little brandy. All right, one more. One more. A and gold. Here we go. I didn't plan on doing this today, but uh, you guys are being so kind. This is a deep cut. They, they would play this one on, on deep cuts. Sirius XM, right? That, that's one of those channels. Yep. Deep, deep cuts. cuts. All right, here we go. Here's a deep cut. Alan Parsons project. Um, yeah. The reason why I got I got into that song recently is because I was watching a documentary and I realized that Alan Parsons was a 
assistant engineer on Abbey Road when he was like 17, and also on Dark Side of the Moon, which is really cool. Some uh, rock and roll history there for you. Uh, I can't, I can't sing that song. I'll play it for you. You want to hear that? Uh, it's out of my range, but I tried. Hey, thanks, thanks for choosing to spend your Sunday afternoon with us, and uh, yeah. Thanks for being here. This, the set list has all has gone awry already. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna reel it back in any minute. This is a song I wrote of. Man, this, this one's got to be ten years old now too. About um, well, lots of things, but you, you ever been on the school kill where you're know, backed up? <laughs> right you, you guys don't know anything about right that. Right on the side of the <laughs> shoulder. <laughs> Man, I don't, I don't miss sitting in that, that's, that scoop kill, wow. That thing, that, that still get backed up like that? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's yeah. a parking lot. I haven't done that in quite, quite a few years, you know, you're just sitting there, yeah. Okay. Slow you go. This song's called Slow You Go, from my, from my buddy Tim up there. Thanks. Yeah, you got it, man.
Tempest turn his back on me When he knows I'll never get far Cause I'm strung out like a dirty rag From the window of a broke down car So slow you go back to the city where you live There comes a time you know when something's gotta get Just so you know, well it's that fight I'll never win I had a back down and I couldn't stick around I'm never going back again All right. Well, uh, I'm going to play another song or two here and then uh, probably take a quick break and maybe grab a little snack or something and come back with you. So that's cool, right? There you go. Or they maybe they force you to you gotta play the whole time. No. <laughs> no I'm just kidding. Um, kind of a little bit overtired and in a silly, silly mood, you know how you get sometimes. <laughs> What's that? The crab dip. Oh, I love that stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to hit that hard. <laughs> <laughs> It'll bring you back. You know what, it, you know what honestly, though, like I said before, um, at the start of the, the whole pandemic thing, I was in upstate New York, and it's kind of a scary place to be. It was the, you know, the, the ground zero sort of thing for the whole, you know, the virus spreading and all that stuff. And uh, music really helps, man. You know, it helps, helps you put your mind at ease. And, bad things are going on and um, George Harrison man you know he just wrote so many positive songs and had such a such a beautiful way of expressing that you know in, into the world and we're so lucky to have his music stick around I, I don't I don't know why he couldn't have lived another 30 years but uh, you know I really wish he, he could have but you know I don't think we're meant to know that stuff but anyway I'll try try to play a George song for you here a good one Tune, almost. Stand by. There's the culprit. This goes out to the coronavirus.
so I must be on my way to start another day. Darkness only lasts in the sing on this particular day. <laughs> Thanks so much. I'm going to do one more song and um, take a little break here. So um, stick around. Enjoy the crab dip. Yeah. Thanks to Mr. Tim up there. And um, enjoy the beautiful evening we're getting here. I thought it was supposed to rain today, someone told me. I don't, I don't ever watch the weather or the news or any of that, but... Um, it's not raining. It's not going. That's a great observation. No, it's not going to rain. <laughs> Profound. Um, but great. And um, we'll be back. Hopefully we'll get this other guitar fixed. And be able to, we got a really cool little set we do of um, some of like the Reckoning era dead stuff and nice. some Almond Brothers and stuff. And we're, gonna kind of, we're saving the, the good ones for last here. So I hope we get that fixed. We'll, we'll, we'll find a way to make it work. If I have to play my guitar into the microphone, I'll do that. <laughs> We're gonna we're gonna power through here. Uh, I'm gonna go out on a limb here. Uh, I'm gonna play another uh, smash radio hit, but okay. this one is um, I think this is a little bit after the um, rise and fall of AM Gold. Uh, this is this is definitely an FM high fidelity radio hit from the late. I feel like it's the late 80s, but I don't know the exact year, and I should, because I like to I'll tell you. I like to nerd out on those things, you know, when albums were released. But the thing that, here's another interesting thing. This is the pref, uh, preface this by saying, uh, I'm a huge Tom Petty fan. This is not a Tom Petty song, but uh, Mike Campbell from the Heartbreakers has been posting all these really cool Instagram videos. You guys see, see them at all? Yeah. He's been talking about, you know, how he wrote some of the songs, the you know, some of those real great Petty. classic Petty songs, and... Uh, and he was tinkering around on the piano a couple weeks ago, and he was like playing this song, and, and he's like, well, he's like, you might have heard, heard this one before, and he played it, and I kind of didn't even really get what song it was until, until he got into it, and then I was like, whoa, that's pretty cool, and he started talking about co-writing with some other people, and I didn't realize that Mike Campbell co-wrote this song, but, uh, but here it is. Like, you couldn't go anywhere without hearing this on the radio for, like, I feel like it was, like, a good ten Five, years. Like, my childhood is, like, this song. And I have another question. What's that? Yeah, I'm about to play it. You're going to see it. You're going to know. You're going to know in two seconds. Um, <laughs> here's another thing, though. You know what a song? I was filling up gas this morning at the gas station. Uh, this has been driving me nuts because I didn't have service, so I couldn't um, Shazam it. But what is that song from the eight, late 80s that was on the radio? I feel like it was on the radio like three times an hour that goes, um, Take these broken wings, learn to learn fly. Learn to fly. Um, what is that? Uh, the Book of Love. Uh, oh, no, no, no. <laughs> it's it's been right, driving me nuts right. all day. I feel like that song was just on the radio. Like and They never turned that song off for like a couple of years. Obviously. Is that like some weird Chicago, late era yeah, Chicago like or something? Or? Chicago, I'll find no, it. I don't think it's Chicago, but it's like... See, you guys don't know either. That makes me feel better. I didn't know if it was real obvious. Like everybody's got their phone out. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going to play that song. <laughs> what is Twisted it? Sister. No! 
No, it definitely wasn't Twisty Sister. No. Oh, Mr. Mister. Oh, right. Yeah, well, I thought we said, I thought you said Twisty Sister. Mr. Mister, yeah. <laughs> I would like to hear Twisted Sisters take yeah, over. Right. <laughs> that is correct, Mr. Mister. Right, here we go. Apologize for butchering Don Henley. I'm gonna take a little break on that note, and uh, we'll be right back. See you in, see you in a couple minutes. Like <laughs> <laughs> oh, he didn't put this together. Yeah, thanks. I mean, that's why I keep you around. You hear? Henley wrote a lot of good songs. Dude, unbelievable. I, I never was into him. I, you know, I, never, I saw him and Stevie like, Nicks together at the oh, Spectrum. Yeah. 
Wells Fargo. I mean, his singing, like that song, the vocal yep. deliverance. Yep. Desperado. Oh my god. I remember when Phil and Friends played Desperado at Montage. Montage Mountain? Everyone was so mad. That he did? I, I, it was my favorite part of the show. Yeah, show. right? Everyone's complaining about it. Come on, Jeff's got a Desperado. He, he's an extremely talented and his vocals are unreal. Well, yeah, those 